morning everybody um just caught up here to my land got some wood unloaded some of it just in a pile out of the dump truck got some of it stacked but right over here that's where i'm gonna put that connex so i'm headed down the road meet a guy for some road base I'm gonna haul a couple loads and get a little site built so here we go start a new project Windows down in Wyoming, 51 degrees, feels like summer. <sighs> that is the best air in the world. That was my first time ever dumping gravel with this trailer. Use my spreader gate. And it turned out pretty good. Started right where my can was. Ended right over here. My paint mark. You can see my paint mark, so. Not too, not too shabby. Save myself a lot of work. I'm gonna get a couple, probably two more loads and then get it all to grade. worked so good last time when my camera wasn't set up on top the GoPro and it's time to work so good I guess beginner's luck <laughs> up here to the property I hauled two loads of road base went back for the third and the loader broke down so I'll have to get that some other time hopefully I can make it work with two loads I'll set up the time lapse when we get up here and start doing some shoveling I shot grade a couple two weeks ago when it was a bunch of snow up here and I was about uh, eight inches difference from one corner from the highest point to the lowest point all right, so that's one corner there, down to the other corner, about by the trailer, over eight foot, down. So I need to bring a little bit of this material into here. That's the high point, right down there is the high corner. And then this is the low corner.
level. Now I'm going to pack it down with the truck. Backside's pretty close. It's where that dirt didn't compact much. It's pretty well level. The whole way along there, the front side sunk about inch to two inches, depending on where you're at. So that's fine. That's why I wanted the third load of gravel. So next weekend, I'll get another third load of gravel and be able to fine tune it. Let this hopefully get a little bit of moisture into this through the week. Set a little, little bit, and we'll fine tune it next weekend. I'm just going to end my day here, clean up this material I brought up, getting a stack of nice. So, here we go, finishing it up. Check out the mounds real quick. See how far we can get until the snow stops. Alright, well, that's a wrap for this week's video and the start of this Connex shed build series um, didn't quite get done everything I wanted to without getting that third load of gravel but got done everything I could with what I had and a fair amount of back breaking work raking that out and shoveling all that but I am grateful that I can even be doing that I thought three months ago my back was hurting so bad I couldn't even walk around so I feel pretty blessed to be able to be healthy again and lots of answered prayers and Glad to be back at it, able to work hard and get after it. So that's it for this video. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you on the next one.